In tonight's WJZ Health Watch, a doctor in Howard County says there are children who have been labeled lazy or learning deficient who are none of those things. As Mike Shue reports, they have a simple problem getting their brain to communicate with their eyes. 16 year old Lindsay Alley's life changed in this room. After getting two D's in school, her mom brought her here. Here to see Dr. Michael Kotlicki. Here to see what her brain was doing with what her eyes were seeing. So when it comes about here, we'll be good. You can watch your eyes. All her life, Lindsay couldn't comprehend the words she read. Her eyes weren't working together. She saw double and couldn't track a line of words on the page. That had to drive you nuts, right? And, and what were you thinking when, you know, clearly people were disappointed in you? I wasn't thinking. I just didn't know. Because I wasn't lazy. I just didn't know it was wrong. Did anybody ever call you lazy? Mm-hmm. But she has a photographic memory and is an A-B student. Dr. Kotlicki says her eye-to-brain connection was faulty. And it is a software problem. It's not a hardware problem. The eyes are fine. The eyeballs are fine. And once Lindsay was diagnosed and began therapy, imagine her mom's relief. She just took off from there. She began reading. She went from D's in her AP psychology quizzes after reading the material the night before, and now she's got bees within the, the eight-week period of time. That was October. And she's not alone. The doctor has a stack of successful reports. Reading is easier and fun. School is so much easier to manage. In her case, this therapy retrained her brain to work with her eyes, therapy that has shown remarkable success in others. The statistics are 95%. 95 percent mm -hmm. no drugs no surgery no kidding in columbia mike shoe wjz eyewitness news mike thank you the test to determine if someone needs vision therapy takes about an hour it's amazing how easy it's is that unbelievable and, and her, her the result is completely different now wow. it's great